Welcome to Live Alive. In today's video we'll start with Liverpool interested in signing £98 million Wolves duo. Liverpool have set their sights on raiding Premier League rivals Wolverhampton Wanderers after upping the ante in their pursuit of Pedro Neto and considering whether to attempt to lure teammate Ryan Aignori to Anfield ahead of on slot's first season at the helm, Give Sports sources have revealed. The Dutch tactician has led the Reds into a new era after being installed as Jurgen Klopp's successor, having seen the Merseyside Giants pay. Former employers Feyenoord a compensation package worth up to £9.4 million, and he is scouring the market for reinforcements as the August 30th transfer deadline edges closer. Slot has been working closely with new sporting director Richard Hughes, who has been tasked with leading Liverpool's recruitment drive after becoming the first appointment since Michael Edwards was named Fenway Sports Group's chief executive of football, and plans have been put in place to welcome arrivals in the coming weeks. Liverpool have been in touch with Neto's representatives and Wolves to discuss the possibility of a summer switch to Merseyside, according to GMS sources and there is a growing expectation that agent Jorge Mendes will push for his client to secure an eye-catching move after being linked with several potential destinations. The winger still has three years remaining on his contract, putting his current employers in a strong position as interested parties mull over whether to test their resolve. But Slot is seriously contemplating whether to lodge a bid as it has become clear that the Portugal international is open to embarking on a fresh challenge. GMS sources have been informed that Liverpool's interest is refusing to go away, which has come as a surprise as it was initially deemed likely that they would focus on alternative targets as they seek competition for the likes of Luis Diaz while Arsenal are also hot on his trail despite both clubs opting against upping the ante at this stage. Wolves are in danger of being the subject of a double raid from Liverpool as GMS sources have learned that Aitnori is also on slot's radar as he looks to make adjustments to the squad he inherited from Klopp and there is a possibility of the Reds being able to leave their counterparts helpless when it comes to negotiating a fee. That is because there have been suggestions that the Algeria international has a release clause worth in the region of £38 million written into his contract, but the Mullino hierarchy have stopped short of confirming whether that is true since the transfer window reopened for business last month. Liverpool are at risk of facing competition from arch-rivals Manchester United as GMS sources recently revealed that boss Eric Ten Hag has explored a potential deal for Aitnori after going lengthy spells of last season without a recognised left-back thanks to Luke Shaw and Tyrell Malaysia struggling with injuries. But GMS sources understand that the Merseyside heavyweights are more keen on landing Neto, resulting in them doing extensive groundwork on the 24-year-old ahead of potentially attempting to lure his Wolves teammate into making the same switch as the deadline edges closer. Liverpool sent Matt O'Reilly transfer message, Brendan Rodgers has confirmed Celtic's stance on Matt O'Reilly's future amid links to Liverpool. The Reds have been credited with an interest in signing the boys midfielder as the summer transfer window rolls on. Liverpool are yet to complete their first signing of the summer, but that has not stopped the rumour mill from being in full swing. O'Reilly is one of the latest players to be linked with a move to Anfield, although the Reds are not alone. Reports in recent days have claimed that Celtic have rejected a second bid from Atalanta for the in-demand O'Reilly. It was claimed by Sky Sports that the improved offer consisted of a £14.3 million initial fee, plus add-ons. However, the same report also claimed that talks between the two clubs remain ongoing, but there is still a gap in valuation as well as the Reds, Juventus and Roma, plus the likes of Atletico Madrid, have also been linked with a move for the Denmark international, but speaking during Celtic's pre-season tour of America, Rodgers has outlined Celtic's determination to keep O'Reilly at the club this summer. However, the former Liverpool boss did acknowledge the challenge that the Scottish Premiership faces in keeping their star names at Celtic Park. He said, we're all quite relaxed about it, O'Reilly's future. Every player has a value, but we see him as a really important player, and while he's here, we'll continue to develop him and improve, there's no update, we're fairly relaxed, you saw him in the game the other night. Rogers then added, he's working so well, but there's nothing to report on him. I think we all understand the people close to Celtic understand the model Celtic works, Matt's been at the club for three years, he's developed into the player he has, and he knows the privilege it is to play for Celtic, and of course, naturally. How it works is the player gets that opportunity to move on. Celtic is a club where you can move on but you don't have to, and it's a very difficult club to move on from. But naturally, with the wages that are on offer for players, then that makes it a real challenge for Celtic to compete at that level.
Liverpool confident of new deal for Trent Alexander-Arnold. Alexander-Arnold's future at Liverpool this summer has been discussed at length with his current deal set to expire next summer, meaning he could leave for free in less than 12 months. Real Madrid had become interested in his services and TalkSport understood that Bellingham was especially keen to reunite with the England international. The two are close friends and often inseparable when representing the national team. However, TalkSport further understands that Liverpool are confident that Alexander-Arnold will sign a new contract at Anfield, ending any speculation over a move away from the club. The right-back has spent his entire career with the Reds having come up through the academy. The 25-year-old has made 310 senior appearances for Liverpool, scoring 19 times and registering an astonishing 81 assists. It has made him one of the best right-backs in the world with Real Madrid looking for a long-term successor to 32-year-old Danny Carvajal but they might have to look elsewhere as Alexander-Arnold looks set to pen his future to Liverpool and remain on Merseyside. Liverpool have already undergone a major change this season with Jurgen Klopp being replaced by On Slot. The Dutch coach was handpicked to succeed the charismatic coach due to his attacking style and willingness to go forward. And that's the final content of today's video, like subscribe to support Live Alive.